What's going on everyone? Austin John plays here and today we're going to be talking about the brand new firmware version 10.0 for the Nintendo Switch. Right now, the Nintendo Switch has a brand new update version 10.0, which actually adds a couple of really, really big and important features. First of all, as far as the avatars, there have been six Animal Crossing avatars added. Where are they? Here they are. Boom, right here. Tom Nook, the Nooklings, Isabel, Orville, CJ, and Flick. Using the news icon, you now have the option to bookmark up to 300 items. I don't know who uses the news tab, that's why you watch my channel, right? If your internal memory is getting full, you now have the option to move data between the system and the micro SD card. That also goes for if your micro SD card is getting full and you want to move stuff off of that and go to your internal memory. You can find this under data management in the system settings. This is actually game information. This is not your save data information. Your save data information is still stored on your internal memory. So this is like the actual game and the DLC. So don't think you're gonna be able to transfer your save data to an SD card and then put it into another Nintendo Switch. It doesn't work that way. The biggest change between the sun now coming out, so now I'm a little blown out, is under controllers and sensors, you now have the option to custom button map. This is only supported for first party Nintendo Switch controllers, meaning the Joy-Cons, the left run, the right one, and the Pro Controller. And basically, if you come in here, you can choose to change what the buttons do. So say, for example, you're playing Animal Crossing and you never use the emotes or anything. You can change R, which is for the text, or ZR, which is for that, and you can make it whatever you want. For my right Joy-Con, I have options for all of the buttons that are on my right Joy-Con. In addition, I have buttons that are on my left Joy-Con. Say, for example, I wanted to make this the A button, I totally could. Boom. Now ZR does A, and R also does A. Perfect. I'm never gonna use those buttons anyways. Now, this is also really neat. So say, for example, you never mess with the view in Animal Crossing. You never do up, you never do down. You can actually change the right stick to the left stick. That means that I can just play with one hand. Because do I actually hit anything on the left controller? I'm not really too sure that I do. Oh, the ZL to bring up my phone. Actually, you know what? I would probably want to make ZRA to make it easier to press down while my thumb is down on the right joystick. Plus is never used in the game. I could remap plus to something else. Actually, plus to ZL would probably work pretty nicely. And I can make this Y for picking up items easier while I'm walking around, boom. When others use this console, be sure to inform them. Now you could also come in here and you can save your mapping, you can load your mapping, and you could also just reset it. So I could save this as option one, and then I can reset it, and boom, done. Now it works like a regular Joy-Con. I could load my mapping. Simple as that. That's one-handed Animal Crossing. And anytime I don't want that, just hit reset. Done, perfect. This also has a variety of other uses in other games. Uh, First thing that comes to mind is Super Smash Brothers Ultimate and just any games for the Switch that don't utilize all the buttons, you're good to go. And then also, something really fantastic to talk about, even though the Nintendo Switch, I believe, supports the Microsoft Adaptive Touch Controller, you say, for example, someone with motion difficulties in one of their two hands, you can then map all of the controls to one controller, one half Joy-Con. So say for example, someone is unable to move their left thumb for moving around, boom, now they can do it with their right thumb, no problem. And that's it for the patch notes for the Nintendo Switch version 10.0 firmware. Uh, download it, remap your controller, have a lot of fun, make your life easier. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the like button. Until next time, Austin John out.